Hello everyone, and welcome back to Neoberg. Um, welcome back to where it all started with this construction material uh, factory and um, this area. This has a lot of, um, well, uh, it's, it's, it's quite prominent in all of our episodes, so it's, it's quite an important area for our uh, region. Um, and with the recent success of not only being able to put in a train line here, in fact I'm going to put another train on this one while we've got the money, and there's a lot of bricks there to take, so might as well make the most of it. Um, yeah, with the recent success of getting in our train line over here, um, I want to put in a train line that I've been talking about since probably like <laughs> I think if not episode one, maybe episode two or three, like quite a long time ago. Um, and that is a train line here through to Alford, which wants now 150 bricks and Berg La Manche that wants 164 bricks. So yeah, this is going to be quite a big line for us, not only probably due to um, money, but also because we've been talking about this for quite a while. Um, I think what we'll do is two separate lines. Well, we could do um, one that goes through and uh, services both. Um, I think it's probably best if we did two that way, um, you know, if they currently want 150 plus bricks, um, that's only going to grow with time. And um, these are two of our larger cities in the game. It only makes sense to future proof it a little bit and allow that to um, go through with as much as it needs. Um, going forward. So, with that in mind, we're going to need to make some changes around here. Um, I don't mean, like, there's going to be some changes around here. I mean, like, some real changes to how things are laid out and um, just improve the area, um, hopefully, um, from that, uh, those changes, hopefully. Um, so, in order to put this train line in, I want to put it in around here. Um, we're going to have to take this road out. And we'll probably do maybe a road through here. Um, I haven't decided yet as to what we're doing. Um, firstly, what we do want is to bring this out in a more sort of street manner and then that will be where the hill will be so we can remove that bit um, if we did do a road through here potentially a bridge over for um, Little Hampton to connect to uh, say uh, uh, Swindon and everything else through here uh, could be a good way to go so with that in mind, if we were to build in a train line here, wow, that actually goes into the um, ground really far there. Uh, we don't really want it to go quite so far down. Um, is there, if we check our lines, this is a relatively flat area. So we should be able to do it maybe like this. This might work a little bit better. Mm. If we put it in so that that's connected there. Even if it is going into the hill uh, a little bit on the end there, um, we could potentially use that. So we could put in a road through that way. There's nothing to say that this route through can't go off this direction. Um, to be fair, we've got this route through, so maybe that makes a lot more sense. So if we can get these into a tunnel sooner rather than later, 
that's probably not that bad of a thing. Um, so if we check out the emissions zones, we don't want to be causing emissions on this side of Alfred, which makes it quite easy because we can literally just put it in here. Um, the receiving end of the train line here which is absolutely fine. In fact, it's probably worthwhile us putting in a road here so that this train line doesn't actually block us off from um, putting a road there going forward. Uh, and actually, we want that bit to be high throughput as well. So... I think we would want that here and we could potentially use it for this fuel line as well going forward so I know we won't, won't be able to afford it right now but if we were to put in a tunnel through to down here first off why is it not tunneling up to here that's a bit annoying but second off, how is it doing on this side? So it is creating some um, crossings here. If we lower it, maybe? I mean, we could remove these um, roads, and then that would be potentially a good way to ensure that stuff comes through. Um, yeah, so... We will probably need to um, build this route back in, uh, but it's just a case of how and where. I would want there to be steps here so that that can get utilised. And then if we build that straight out down here, and this up here, then what we can do is delete this back here, and here and here, and create a almost angled way through. Obviously, we're going to need more money in order to put in um, the train tracks through because this is going to be a really big tunnel. Um, how about on this side with emissions? Oh, perfect. Literally, Burglamarsh is set up perfectly for this train line. Um, I will probably put it around here somewhere. Um, although there's a lot of traffic here. We could potentially reduce that if we put it somewhere else. But then again, this is very flat. This is almost perfect for a train line. Let's just upgrade that road. And then what we can do is connect in this through here. these connect through if we remove that one we can go out in this direction a sudden we've got more connections for Burglar Marsh here um, for the traffic to use it's just a case of 
how they will use it. So we'd be wanting to go off in this direction. If we put it here, then we can also use it for the machines factory here down the road if we wanted to. So that's a really good way to connect up the machines to the river because we've already got this connected here. So that could be a possible um, way of making a better connection through that way going forward. Um, I think what might be worth doing is removing the junction here. So if we delete it back to maybe this point, we could do a more clean way through. So let's go ahead and do that now. take this go straight out from there and then have that connect in there then that will be a bit better of a connection um, we will have to do something so that there's another connection through this way to avoid going through Swindon with all that traffic but for now, we can leave this as is, and hopefully that will be a bit faster of a connection through for the two cities. Um, as for the connection through to uh, Burglar Marsh, that will be coming through this way, uh, down to this one here. Right, we do have a collision with this mine. And it's annoying because that literally goes into a tunnel and then out of a tunnel and then into a tunnel. If we went underneath, it's probably fine. Uh, so that's 101 million. Are you smoking something? That's ridiculous. How is that so much? Blimey. Well, we've got to uh, save some money up, it seems. Um, okay. Well, with that in mind, where are we spending our money and it not coming back through? These are approaching not making us money. They're not quite not making us money yet, but they are approaching that direction which will be bad. A hundred and... How much? How, like, a hundred... Just... A hundred million. A hundred million. me. That is a ridiculous amount of money. I can't believe that. A hundred million. How? Just... Just... Just how? That's ridiculous. Um, I'm going to put in the train line here to take my mind off of it a little bit. <laughs> so we're going to put in some steps here. Although they're not connecting to the road, which is a bit annoying. Because oh, it's way higher. Why is it off so much? It's really hard to get this... Perfect, like that. So, let's try that again. Now, there's collision. But it works there, so we'll go with that. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. A hundred million. A hundred million. It's not even like, oh yeah, it's 89 million or something like that. It's a hundred million million flat out what on earth a hundred million 
I just don't believe it. I can't believe that it's that much. That's a gargantuan amount of money. Even in this game. Like, a hundred million? What? A hundred million. Can you believe it? I can't. I'm still dumbfounded. Like, maybe I'm just being silly. I mean, it is a very long tunnel. Um, but that just seems like a huge, huge amount of money for what it is. Um, I just, I just, I don't know. So number four, it needs to go up here. Where it can then go to number one. Number two, if it has to. And then that removes the need for the other uh, road line here. So we can actually get rid of this now. sure I want to delete that line. A hundred million. At least it's a nice round number for us to aim for. Let's look on the positive sides of things, shall we? It could be worse, it could be 200 million. <laughs> oh my giddy aunt, that's a huge amount of money. Like, how are we going to even afford that? I mean, we do have 30 million already, I suppose. That is ridiculous. I'm just trying to think if I've ever had a tunnel cost so much. I don't think I have. I don't think it's ever cost quite so much. Like, how? This one costs 74. I mean, it is a fair distance, to be fair. But still, 100 million? Wow, wow, where you are. However, from these lines, currently, we are making a lot of money saying that. It's not really a great deal of money. Um, it could be more. Um, wow. A hundred. Just, just a hundred. Just a hundred mil. In fact, it's going to cost 200 mil plus to get all this in. Is it even worth it? I hope so. I'm going to try raising this bit. Hopefully it doesn't look too out of the ordinary. Just so that we can get the tunnels in a little bit easier. Two hundred million. Two hundred million. That's a gargantuan amount of money. Do we have anywhere where... Oh, industry statistics, town statistics, station statistics. Here we go. Do we have anywhere that's overloaded? No. Good. Fantastic. That's exactly what I want to hear. 
everything's working the way it should be. Uh, even my escape key, <laughs> it turns out. I just don't know what to say. Like... Berg the Marsh Line is quite busy. We could probably improve the Berg of the Marsh line on this end. Um, as we saw earlier, there is a bit of traffic here. So it's all coming through this way. Potentially what we could do is have a more direct route through for the Berg of the Marsh. Yes, it's another tunnel but it would be, to one of our biggest cities, a lifeline that it could really do with. To be fair, we have been considering moving this further out for a fair amount of time. So that Bought tree can grow even further. So I think this would be a large country road coming through this way. And it will replace this here. We'll just delete this back for the time being. Um, we can keep it there. Uh, we just literally want to have something that comes through a little bit better for Burglar Marsh. So, how's this looking? Ooh, wow. That's a fair old uh, <clears throat> aqueduct there. We don't want that. We don't want any of that. So, this must be a fair drop to cause that. Because it literally can't go any lower. Oi, oi, oi. Million. So I think what we'll do is we'll have a curve route through this way and a road coming off here which will go through to here. Then we'll upgrade this road through and even here we'll upgrade this road through because it's going to become quite a major route through for our larger city. We probably want to remove this bit because we want to come through here, connect in there. And then come down this side of Alford so that we've got a connection down here. So we would probably remove this bit. 
j'espère. And in fact, we've got another city down here, just in Penwith. And a road that comes through from just in Penwith, which almost naturally goes in that direction. So I'd like to utilize that. We might as well go this side of Should have checked that on the other side as well, to be fair. Yep, that's fine. We can upgrade it if we need to. Let's just check down here. But this is going to be... I don't know why I've got it paused. Every second that I've got it paused, I'm losing out on potential profit to help me <laughs> pay for that 100 mil train line. That's just, oh yeah, 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 yeah. I can't believe it's that much. I genuinely can't believe it's 100 and, what, 200 mil? It's 200 mil is what it is. That's just bananas. So this route through goes to um, Burglar Marsh down here from Alford. So we might as well change this a little bit so that it utilizes that. Um, we can put that connection in here, although we need it to go around this. And then we can take that bit out, put this in here, and then we can upgrade. Is it really worth upgrading if we don't remove some of the unnecessary curves? Just so that it's Hopefully, okay, let's just raise that up a little bit so it's not quite as dramatic on the landscape. And then, I mean, we might as well come into this side of Burglar Marsh and try and... Um, provide an alternate route in. So with that, I'll delete that back and then connect in this to here. We'll upgrade these routes through so that hopefully they get a little bit more use. And then plug in that side. We might as well continue out this road so that it connects in. So, and that connects in Alford to Burglar Marsh quite well. What we're going to do here, I'm not 100% sure yet. Obviously, we've got this route through, which is really the main connection down here. Um, 
but we do have these old roots through that we don't want to necessarily remove completely. So if we could do a road over... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> if we could do a road over... That would probably be... For the best. Collision, collision. <laughs> no collision. No collision. Oh no, collision. Um, hmm. How are we going to do this? Maybe what we can do is do a road that comes over and it more sort of connects these areas a little bit better. in there. We want this to be ground. And then I'm not too sure what we do on this side. Didn't we want to remove some of these roads? So we can do that if we maybe connect up here. We will put this road back in. In fact, we'll have a road that comes through, which will probably be really good for Berg the Marsh to connect up to, say, Coulsdon down here. Um, all we need to do is go back flat to the ground. And then this coming out this direction down here something like that now this has been here for quite a while but admittedly it's not necessarily the best um, so, if we were to possibly connect through here,
we can connect this in in time. I think for now, it's probably best to just connect this through. If we did straight road free for these, that's where this can connect into. This can come out this direction and connect in there. Oh, we haven't connected this back up. Is that colliding? We're trying to connect it in. Um, we could potentially do a road down to Ilkley with time and then Lowton from there. Yeah, hopefully this will help a fair deal with all the traffic that's coming through this area. The, uh, <laughs> the Bricks line still comes through Bawtree, which is a bit of a pain. Um, we can't really do much about that. But hopefully this will be a lot better for Burglar Marsh down here. Um, yeah. This has been a fair amount of reworking, to be fair. But we're almost at that golden 100 mil point of no return where we put in a train line that may make us money I hope it will make us money we really deserve for it to make us money at that much money 100 mil is just ridiculous but yeah we've done a fair amount here and it's some big changes um, we want to make sure that this stuff keeps moving so if we put another another line on another vehicle on this line, is this starting to get to it? Fifty percent. It's gone up. All of these is getting to where they need to go. How much money is that line actually making us? Not a great deal, but it's fundamental for keeping our brick empire afloat. Because if this stuff isn't getting to where it needs to go, and it really isn't at the moment, then we ne need to get that moving. And Coulston demands bricks? I thought we were already providing bricks to cause them but anyway um yeah i think we're gonna leave it there we have done a fair amount to um this area 
building in or improving the, the highway through. Um, hopefully, we're helping Burglar Marsh with some uh, transport issues that they were having, possibly. It looks like we need to move this, but that we can do next next time. Um, one thing's for sure, this will be probably the last time that we uh, make a massive change to these um, highways through here for a little while. Uh, let's just connect up here, because we didn't do that. And this will serve as one of the main routes through for Alfred to St. Just. But yeah, that's... Um, I just can't believe it's 100 million. It's 100 million for a tunnel. That's a lot of money. That is a lot of money. But hopefully we can uh, save up that amount. It looks like we have a lot of bricks that need to go through to Alfred. Let's bump that up. Um, but yeah, hopefully a train line will help that, that route. Um, uh, if you've enjoyed the episode, then let me know with your uh, with your thumbs. Yeah, until next time, have a good one. Thanks, goodbye.